Wayne, tell us uh, what happened a couple of days ago. Yeah, we were at a, um, an address in Coomera in relation to an incident that uh, happened earlier on in the day. And Boson and myself and another officer were out the back. When the police have knocked on the front door, one of the suspects has run out of the, the rear of the dwelling. And um, we've challenged him. Unbeknownst to us, there was a uh, pit bull following him. And uh, as a result, the dog fights incurred. The pit bulls grabbed him on his uh, lower left leg and caused some significant uh, muscle uh, trauma to the leg. How did Boson react in the attack? Oh, Boson's uh, not shy to a bit of a scrap. He uh, gave as good as he got. Um, it's just one of the hazards of the job, I'm afraid. And I guess once those pit bulls lock on, it's hard to get them off, isn't yeah, it? It was very hard. We've, we've actually sprayed the dog with a capsicum spray. I've uh, gone hands-on with him. We, still, we got him separated for a short bit, but then he's hooked back on again. And eventually we had to taser the dog to get him off. What sort of attention did Boson get? He uh, was afterwards? straight to the vet, at, uh, down the emergency vet clinic, and uh, they've cleaned his wounds and given him antibiotics and anti-inflammatories. He'll be off work for a couple of weeks, but he'll be fine. Our biggest worry was that he may have broken a bone or torn tendons, because that could put him off work for months. But luckily, that didn't happen. Wayne, you sounded pretty panicked when you are on your way to the vet that day. Oh, there was a lot of blood. Uh, like I said, I was more worried of the fact that if he'd have done any damage to his tendons or his uh, broken a bone, we'd have been off for a while. He's a pretty special dog, isn't he? He is. He is. You've been with him now for how long? I've had him since he was two months old. So he's now, he'll be seven in May. Best mate? Oh, yes. I mean, we spend, I spend more time with him than I do with my family. Uh, was it actually, you know, watching, I guess, your best mate then be in this attack? Was it, how was it watching it? And how well, was it, it wasn't a matter of watching it. We were both involved in it, so it's like everything. We go in together. Wayne, just go through um, some of Boson's accolades and his achievements over the years. Uh, he's done a lot over the years. Probably too many to mention. Um, he's, I think he's pretty well known for what he's done around the place. But like a lot of the police dogs, he's just getting a bit more recognition than... And some of them, and some of them do have done some terrific jobs that just haven't got the recognition. And what about yourself? You, do you deserve some of that recognition too? <laughs> I don't know about that. Like I said, I do know more than what any of the other police dog handlers would be doing. Just that we happen to be in the media at the moment. So you think he's the star? Oh, he definitely is. Can he leave the fly alone? <laughs> Sit. Sit. So just a couple of days after, how is he feeling today? You have uh, he's noticed? actually probably pretty good today. Yesterday he was a little bit sore and sorry in the morning, but uh, he's, he's getting better every day. Any special treats for Boson? No, uh, he don't get any scare. Yeah, he's, he gets his normal treats. He gets looked after pretty well. So if you take him all his fight, he doesn't surprise by any of his No, he's very good with people. He's, he's a bit of a media tart, actually. He likes it. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Lovely. All right. Thanks. Thanks.